So this is... oh! Layers of Fear is a unique, immersive game experience in which every decision affects the narrative. As in life, it is the doors you open, the memories you take with you, and the shadows you explore that will define who you are. This may be our game, but it is your journey. Well, you did my job for me. Oh, I love this soundtrack already. Sorry, I'm vibing. Alright, so, this is a game I've heard very good things about, and I did not start the timer. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, we're off to a great start. So this is a game I've heard very good things about that takes place as an artist and his work. And there's a deep psychological element to this game, and that is exactly all that I know about it. So I've yet to find a horror game that has really scared the pants off of me, as we've encountered in Slender and Soma. I'm not spooked easily, so we'll see if this game can achieve that. I'd really be happy if it did. Hmm. Whoop. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. Well, gee, thanks. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. A girlfriend? Finish it. Oh. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. Oscar Wilde, The Picture of Dorian Gray. That's a fantastic quote. I really like that. Um, okay, we're in. Oh my god, sensitivity. Up, please. Uh, anything else I need? Oh, okay. Okay, all the way up, side titles on, good. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Okay. Uh. <laughs> well, that's nice. Um, okay. Uh. Okay, amnesia style. I saw a rat. Oh, this is gorgeous. Hi. Uh, oh, I can rotate it. It's a dog collar. Pop. Pop. Popkle. Popkle. Well, that's cute. There we go. Oh. What a lovely banquet. I'm in love with this house already. Spice cabinet. Let me look at paprika. That is not paprika. <laughs> I hate to break it to you. That's paprika. Some garlic. I feel like I'm in a. <laughs> I feel like I'm in Skyrim all of a sudden. Just alchemy ingredients. I love it. I can move faster with L2. Well, that's lovely. You want to tell me why, though? Oh, the ambient thunder. I got the I got the volume maxed out in my head. Oh, here we go. Dear sir, we would like to ask you to seek 
to cease bothering our pest control specialists, as well as refrain from sending us any more of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of a rodent infestation of any kind, and, as, and such had decided not to act further than a prophylactic spray. Please treat this letter as a final warning, or else the next envelope you receive from us will be from our lawyers. With best regards, Carl Denton. Pesky Pets Pacification. Okay. So I've got a rodent problem, do I? Whoop. Nothing in here for me? I don't want to be dicks and leave it open. Sir, I didn't touch the workshop, just like you asked, although I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care for so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. Okay. What do we got? Whoa, basement. Why not? Am I limping? Whoop. Hmm. Whoa. That was in my left ear. I mean no rodent infestation. I heard them right just now. Uh reading C D F C Do 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 Wait. Whose report card is that? That's terrible. What? I'm gonna get the rat. Get the rat. Aw. I'm probably not taking this as seriously as I should. Oop, I'm stuck. Oh, I came down here for nothing. Mmm. Wish I could sing like that. My voice can go low, but I can't reach those high octaves. I can't do a falsetto to save my life. Sorry, I'm also having alcoholic beverage. I left the water on. In my house? There we go. I have no reflection. That's dismaying. Plus the toilet. No? Can't flush the toilet. What about the bathtub? No, sir. What do we got? Uh, one below the knee prosthesis. Oh, I do. A, I'm, I am limping. I have a prosthetic leg. How the hell did they fuck up the le length? They did. <laughs> Oh, that sucks. Bing bong. Um, okay. Oh. Hmm. Getting heavy alcoholic vibes here. I'm sorry for yesterday. You were right. I overreacted. It's just that this isn't about me. It's about her. Everything I do, I do with her best interest in mind. I guess I've always believed that in I'm in that in an imperfect world it's worth to strive for perfection. Ah, uh, now I'm starting to sound like my father. I will work on my temper. The, I promise we'll talk later. I love you. Okay. Some rags. What time is it? Looks like just past midnight. All the good things happen after midnight. Oh my. Oh dear. Can I... Oh, I can zoom. It's the right stick. That's interesting. I'm trying to catch any symbolism I can from this art. <laughs> what is that? 
It's a bearded baby. That's great. Some booze. Oh, I love this. Ooh. Is that the song that's playing? That'd be cool. Can I play? Ugh. Oof. Jeez, I get it. Okay. <laughs> God, I am terrible. I've uh, been working all night. Don't wake me up. I'm coming in. Oh, I love that. Stumbling all around, stumbling all around. <laughs> I love it. Sorry, I couldn't sleep. The leg's been acting up again. Figured I, mi I might as well do some work. Love you. What do we got? Galactic's grand opening in flames. Disastrous fire at the new, new department store leaves dozens fighting for their lives. The long-awaited opening of the Galact. Okay, something about a something about a fire. Hmm. Just looking for context clues. Whoop. What do we got? The new, new face of music. A night at the opera becomes a night to remember. I might not be a how. Blank might not be a household name yet, but, but just give her time. The incredibly talented multi-instrumentalist gave an astounding performance last night, winning over even the most ardent naysayers. She was simply astounding. I haven't seen such passion and energy, passion, energy, and skill in years," stated famed uh, pianist Daniel Richer. He was not alone in his praise. It seems that even Anthony Giles, one of Blank's harshest, harshest critics, has finally seen disparaging comments about the artist, uh, stating that, Jesus Christ, I swear to God I'm dyslexic. All my words keep blending together. Stating that there's more to performing music than enthusiasm and a pretty face. When asked if, after witnessing last night's performance, he regrets these words, Mr. Giles gave us a look that can only be described as a mixture of awe and embarrassment. Pressed for an answer, he simply said yes. We caught up with the star blank. Mmm. Well, I know I'm not a musician. That might be my wife. <laughs> oh, let's see. Whoa, what the hell was that? What was that? Strange. Oh, look at the puppos. Cute. Is that Popco, maybe? One of them, maybe. I feel like I've seen this painting somewhere. I don't think that this... I don't think that one's this guy's original. Oh, there's the baby again. <laughs> oh, it's great. Oh, there's a key. Whoa. Oh my. Oh. I'm guessing that's little, yeah, that's little Red Riding Hood. Yikes. I'm sorry, I'll make it up to you. Tonight, it's all about you and me. Let's make it special. You promised. Mm. Now, what do we got? My dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some rough times right now. I really do. That's why I've agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place. For old times' sake. I even deliberately gave you a trivial task because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you could draw in your sleep. 
what I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare fuel you submitted for a kid's bedtime story. There is no way in hell I'm using this, and I already regret to... I already... Ag Jesus Christ. Already regret agreeing to a payment in advance. Please get your shit together. Your old pal, Liam Brickson. Liam Brickstone. Whispered Tale Publishing House. Yeah, I'm with Liam on this one. I suppose that's what... That's the story of Little Red Riding Hood. It's a bad, bad world out there. Alright, I got the key. Oh, wait. There was one room over here, wasn't there? Okay, then. <laughs> oh, this is the kids' room. She has an interest in dolls. I see beer. <laughs> the only thing I could make out of it was beer. <laughs> I'll drink to that. Ugh. It's leaking through the cup. It sucks. What we got? Ah, oh, little toy soldier. Okay. This is fascinating. Nope, locked. Okay. I can't jump or do anything of the sort. Alright, back downstairs. Yeah, it's, I've got a prosthetic leg and I'm like limping a little bit. It's a nice touch. Alright. Oh, this way. Oh, it's time to die. Wait, is that the actual time right now? No, okay. It's just past midnight here right now. I was like, ooh. Oh, okay. <laughs> Get it right this time. Ooh. Give, give. What do we got? Brush case? Woof. <laughs> oh, that's good. Okay. Oh dear God. I may have a drink I may have a drinking problem. I definitely have a drinking problem. <laughs> Oh god. What about this? Oh my. Woo! It's a lot of stencils. A lot of broken stencils. Really like this for some reason. I'm not sure why. Can I see myself? Kinda looks like I have a reflection, but I can't tell. Oh, uh, okay. What do we got here? Woof. I got a trophy. It's covered for a reason. There's nothing here. Looks like somebody splattered... Looks like somebody threw a hot dog at my painting. <laughs> Just ketchup and mustard. Um... Okay. Get it right this time. What am I so? Do I paint? Am I supposed to paint here? Oh, excuse me. What's in here? Can I crouch? I cannot crouch. Okay. All right. Open. Whoa. Oh. Oh, it's one of these games. Okay, I'm all smiley now. Open.
Hmm. Just out of reach. Woof. All right then. Chair. I want to sit in chair. Just out of reach. Oh, it's different. It's different. Oh, I like this already. Huh. Looks like a really messed up rendition of The Last Supper. Going in circles. Hmm. Go back to sleep, friend. You're drunk. Uh... Dear sir and madam, we must kindly, albeit strongly, urge you to keep your voices down during the night. Your, mar your marital problems, while regrettable, are a private matter and should be re and should remain that way. There are certainly of they are certainly of no concern to us, and especially our children. Please consider that not everyone is a freelance artist. Some of us has to have to get up early and work for a living. We need our sleep. We must also warn you that if things continue the way they are now, we will be forced to call the police. Sincerely, your very tired neighbors. A little passive-aggressive there. Why don't you go to hell? Hmm. Anything? I'm be thoroughly checking. Oh. Save the date. Uh, blank requests the pleasure of your company to celebrate their wedding on Saturday, the 9th of June at St. Luke's Chapel at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. 9, 6, 2. Let's try it. No? Okay. Whoop. Hmm. Whoop. Well, there's my... Whoa. 485. Okay. I got my numbers. There we go. Yeah. The past holds back. Look closer. There's whispering. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So? Will you marry me? <laughs> really narcissistic way to put that, my guy. That is a rock, though. That's beautiful. Okay, then. Oh. There's a door there now. Never forget. Squee! Oh, it's the chair. Grandma? It stopped rocking. Stumbling all around, stumbling all around. Here we go. You've been snooping around my workshop. Workshop? Workshop again. For the last time, you were not allowed in that room, even if the door happens to be open. I forbid it. This is your last warning. Next time, you'll have, a, you'll have to look for a new job. Hmm. Must be the house taker. Okay. Chair. So I've deducted that my wife is a musician and my child is terrible in school. Deer! Deer! I love deer. Where's the rest of you? Oh. Wee! 
spin to win. Everyone on Earth is getting dizzy. Still spinning. Damn. What the hell is that? Oh, God, Jesus. <laughs> you got me. Okay. Why are you looking at me like that? It's a very disapproving look. Oh! Dust, mice, even in my lungs, grotesque vermin dirt, there is always more. What's your problem with rats? Oh, I got another trophy. The artist's impression. Okay. Ah, there we go. Oh, hi. <laughs> Well... Well, that was a thing. Why was that a thing? Oh my god. Um, I... Uh, do, 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 do. You guys can pause this and read it if you want. I'll go back and do the same. I got another trophy, Scraps of Love. Oh, I can't turn the light back off. Okay. Good enough. Well, okay then. We fell through the floor. Kerchunk. Deer! Oh, well, that's neat. Oh, you're up there now. Trying to figure out what this is supposed to be, like some kind of rendition of Medusa. It kind of looks like a man's face, though, not gonna lie. Oh, there's the baby. Get off the deer. What are you doing? Stupid. Okay. Squeak! Okay. Something's gonna happen. Yep, I saw that coming. Paint deep lies. Oh. Now, tiny bit Whoa. to the left. Yes. Hello. Just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> God, do you practice being creepy? <laughs> I'm not that round. Aw. <laughs> I think she looks good. She's very pretty. Whoa. Screen shook. Squeak. Hmm. Rats. Did that rat just run in the fire? No! Why? Aww. Well, that's a beautiful painting. I love that. Ah, ba ba. You all about? Whoa! Oh, she's gone. Okay. Well, pardon me. <laughs> I kind of half expected that, but that was funny. Alrighty. Well, I think that's a good way to end this off. I'm going to start going back to 30-minute episodes, because I feel an hour is too long now. But let me know how you like this. I'm enjoying it so far. I'm excited to get into the meat and potatoes of this. So, thank you guys so much for watching this very first episode of Layers of Fear. I hope you all enjoyed. I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next episode. Jane! Also, that's... Oof. That's not great. Jane! <laughs>